You'll never guess where I was. Dollar Tree. Hello people, my name is Fox and welcome to Random Pack Openings, a video series where I find random packs of whatever the hell happens to be on sale at Dollar Tree or a dollar at some other store and I open up for your viewing pleasure. Today, I got quite the cavalcade of cartoon comedy starring Seth McForlan. Got myself some more magic repacks. I'll be opening that interchangeably throughout the video, but I will also be opening some random shit that I happen to find. They got more stock of, uh, of crap. We're gonna start off with some anime cards. Attack on Toten. Let's turn it right side up. There we go. There's the main character. Uh, Jim. If it's not blatantly obvious, I am not the biggest anime fan. There's only two animes I ever really remember, and it's... I don't remember. But Attack on Titan is not one of them. Although I do know of the show. It's a show where kids fight dinosaurs. It's actually a show where a bunch of guys fight giants that are naked and run around in a stupid way. Uh, it is a good show from what I've heard, as well as an excellent manga series, but me being the non-anime fan I am, I know dick about it. However, trading cards always draws my attention, so I found it, bought it, and we're gonna open it. What is it? I don't know. I, I'm guessing some kind of game. Also, I have the good knife on the side over here, just in case, just in case we need it for some cutting, which, uh, you know, with one of these uh, packs I'm gonna be opening, we're probably going to. Alrighty, so here we have Strength. I'm gonna assume that's his name. What's on the back? Metax. Then we have com Camaraderie. I thought it said Commander. And uh, they're filling their energy tubes with Energon juice. I don't fucking know. Uh, Christina Lenz. She is indeed. Special. That's oh, insulting. Fucking hell. Synchronous Synchronicity? Synchronicity? You gotta cheer up, man. You're too you're too somber. You, so that was a pile of cards. Attack on Titan. I'm gonna go ahead and say don't buy that, because it's boring. Hang on to magic. This thing I know. The good Christian wholesome game. Alright, 20 cards. Could get a rare. It's actually, I believe it's a one in five chance of getting a rare from what I've read. Uh, which is fairly good, but you never know. You get some cool stuff anyway. Eye gouge, that's disgusting. Stonehaven medic medic. Hamlet Captain. Mog Flunkies, Ingenious Scab, if I can get it, it's a Garden Priest, that is painted by Therese, Niel Therese Nielsen, who recently did the San Diego Comic Con promos, which look goddamn amazing and are going to be worth a ton, of a ton of money, a ton of land too, Salt Road Patrol, McKinney Patrol, McKinney Devil, it's actually Forge Devil, Duty Bound Dead, uh, my friend built a skeleton deck, I might give him that, I thought that was a good land at first, Unknown Shores, do another flip around. Illusionary Wrappings. Nimbus Swimmer. That's uh, a Gate Crash card from that set. I don't remember what set that's from. Ryle. Uh, Spark of Creativity. Ooh, a Foil Plummet. Does that mean we got a rare? Strider Harness. Ground Shaker Sliver. Evolving Wilds. And a Minotaur Sure Shot. No rare, but we got a Foil Plummet, which, you know, in Limited is really good. Too bad this isn't Limited. Hey, you guys like Walking Dead? Look! Dog tags featuring him and her. I burped as I was saying that. Uh, that is, I don't know. I don't watch Walking Dead. I haven't had cable for like a year and a half. I haven't seen any good shows. However, it feels like it's a carabiner in there. That's what that is. I'm pretty sure I'm saying that right. Carabiner. I could be wrong. It feels like there is one in there and I needed one. So I bought it. Let's open this damn thing up. AMC TV series. Let's, I'm testing the autofocus on this thing. It's pretty good. Uh, where's the opening? Oh, here's the opening with my knife. I can't even do it. Come on. I hit something. I fucking no. Oh, it's okay. I only hit what appears to be a piece of metal. So, you know, that's always good. Uh, oh, it's not a piece of metal. It's a zombie. It's, uh, one of those... I forgot what they're called. But it's like a fake holographic. It's not doing anything. It's just looking for... And then we have, yep, we have a Krabner and a sticker, or not a sticker, a dog tag. Oh, there's something else in there. Uh, ooh, a key ring. That is also useful. This is just a this is just a bag of useful things. And we have, hey, there he is. There's Daryl. Daryl. I forgot his name. I hope it's in here. 
Daryl, I was right, Daryl Dixon. Daryl Dixon, star of the new Hideo Kojima game. What the fuck is this game stranding? Uh, I do like this more though, and uh, I needed a key ring, so, you know, goodbye for a dollar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Having too much fun with a zombie thing. Let's open some fucking crap. Great. Yu-Gi-Oh. Star Pack Vrains. That's not how you spell veins. Let's just open this up so I get it over with. I'm having a good time making fun of the stupid names of cards. Like, uh, Trickstar can, 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 okay, that. Uh, Stack Reviver. An Air Cracking Storm. These names weren't as stupid. I was kind of hoping they would be stupider. I mean, Stack Reviver is... Uh, kind of dumb, I guess. It looks like a server. Little stars. Anybody? I'm, I'm wondering, because I haven't seen one in Jersey. The dual terminals that, uh, I've seen them. They had them everywhere in New York, but do they still do those? Those dual terminals where you can play, like, a fake game of, of uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! And then you get, like, a little promo. Uh, those were fun. I remember those being fun, because it was like a buck, and you get a really cool promo. And one of the promos was, at one point, worth, like, a hundred-something bucks. It was, like, one of those white blue dragon things that... I have fond memories of. Um, while I'm speaking, I'm just gonna go ahead and get some satisfaction. Oh, there we go. Oh God, it feels so good. Get knives. I'm really pissing off the Yu-Gi-Oh fanboys, aren't I? More magic, the gathering. Yay, your ring. All right, uh, hopefully this one will be better. There actually were only two of these left, so I'm hoping I got the last two good ones, which judging by the first pack that I opened of this is not the fact, a case. I can't open these things, nor can I speak. First card is a foil giant spectacle. Yay. Giant mantis. Giant maw. It's actually abundant maw. Although, you know, synonym. Lost in the mist. Village cannibals. Crackdown construct. Wing crafter. Bitter bow, bitter bow sharpshooters. Hey, overcome. That ain't terrible. Flip it around. Disowned ancestor. Flip it. That a rare. Oh no, it's a Brimstone Mage. That is from Rise of the Eldrazi's, I think? Looks like it. Looks cool. Never saw that card before. Flip it around one more time. We got Flesh Pulper Giant. Going on with the theme of Giants. Flipping the shit around. We got Servo Schematic. Trusted Force Mage. Let me flip it around one more time. Come on, I'm not pissed yet. Dutiful Servants. Tormenting Voice. Also a good card. Fortified Rampart. R Regicide. Okay, from Conspiracy. Hyena Pack. Impeccable Timing. Hand. So I just I just looked at the carabiner. I don't know what to call this thing. I just looked at the the clip thingy. It says not for climbing. <laughs> yeah, no shit. You try using this for climbing. You put any amount of stress on this thing, it's gonna snap. Yeah, AMC, The Walking Dead, responsible for someone actually not walking and will be dead if you attempt to use that for climbing. Last thing for the video, Skylanders Swap Force. I bought it because there's two of them. Save me some money. Yeah, I don't know dick about Skylanders. All I know is that everyone at Flea Market sells tons of these things, and I don't know why. Jumbo pack, 18 cards. Paquet Jumbo, 18 cartes. By Tops. You know, makers of such wonderful bullcrap. All right, open this. Tops has made some garbage. Like, look at the history of Tops's like, card production. They have made crap. So, I'm expecting good things from this. And we have here a free ranger. Looks like a chicken, so you know, free range makes sense. I'm getting awful with these jokes. Captain K9, that's so clever. Sp <laughs> Spyro in a trucker hat. All right, looks like uh, early Kyler from Squidbillies, but okay. Uh, Gremlin Goldslinger. Cool. Magna Loop. So far, nothing funnier than, uh, than trucker hat. Gonna hold on to that. Electrical Storm. Uh, Scorp. Scorp sounds like a name I'd make up. It's stupid. Gorilla Drilla. Okay. And Trogmander. Okay. I do like the name Trogmander. Is there like barcodes on the backs of these or something? Because I know, I know Skylanders is like an amiibo thing where you can, uh, you have like the figure and you tap it to the little game thing and you play, but that doesn't look like it actually does anything. It certainly doesn't feel like there's any chips in here, so I don't know what these are for. What are these for? Are these a game? What do I do with them? Contact customer service. I will be doing that, Tops, because I'm sure your customer service is just as good as your quality of cards. Pack number two. Well, technically, pack, same same part of the same pack, but you know. 
Cool. We got the fabled security card to make sure you don't steal this from the dollar store. I'm sure that's very... Wait, the dollar store doesn't even have scanners. What the fuck's the point of that? Eruptor! He's puking lava. Cut to the quick. Uh-huh. Sure. Uh, umbrella hat. This game is Team Fortress 2, isn't it? It's just as fast with hat. Can I stop getting sideways cards? Crystal shard. I'm just gonna leave it like this. Rainbow rider. Here we go. Prism break. He looks cool, actually. Not gonna lie. Hammering away. Mr. Tree Folk Man. There you go. Whoa. Okay. There we go. That's a thing. Hey, we got a foil. Foil wash buckler. I have actually seen this figure before. It looks cool. It's a pirate octopus guy, which is, you know, also clever, but whatever. And, uh, Wash Buckler was an Orphan Mermesquait. Okay, I'm gonna stop there. What is this? Is this part of a puzzle? This appears to be part of a puzzle. That's, uh, that's clearly from the movie Robots, which is a fantastic movie starring a fantastic comedian. Uh, not Robin Williams. He was funny. The other comedian who played the main character. He was so, so good. I hate that movie. Alrighty, so that was, uh, Skylanders. I'm gonna go ahead and keep Trucker Hat, and I'm gonna start cutting up the rest. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you later with more videos. Tell me what you thought of the camera angle, or uh, the camera quality, I should say, because, uh, you know, I'm using a new camera, phone, had to get a new phone, cost me a lot of money. Want to make sure I got my money's worth. Uh, hope I will see you guys later, but until then, enjoy that sound. There we go. I'm not going to cut that one up. That one looks cool. I will cut this one up, though. What's that, Yu-Gi-Oh? Oh, it's okay. You want to get cut up, too? Here. We'll cut that up, too. I love this knife.